Normally I like to bring you all more positive, entertaining videos of me being a dude on my dirt bike, but it's going to be a more sad, somber video because somebody unfortunately lost their life. Pretty sad, tra traumatic story. I'll get into it more, but I wasn't even going to make this video, but then I realized that Dorian, he was the homeless man that lived in the streets. Like, nobody's, he's not going to get like a real funeral or anything, so we could at least do something to celebrate his life for the short almost year I, we knew him like give him some recognition recognition or just you know some like a, a tribute or something because I don't know what is gonna happen like if he's getting a funeral or anything so I figured I might as well do something for him because he was somebody I call a friend that I met through motorcycles I think it was really cool these two-wheel machines kind of brought us together so I made this tribute of all the good times we had with Dorian because he was always in a good mood, always cracking jokes, always putting a smile on everybody's face around him. He was never in a bad mood, which was a unique thing and a, a great characteristic to have. So we'll miss Dorian, but I made this little tribute for him to kind of memorialize him, and then I'll talk a bit more about it after. What up, man? We thought we lost you. We really didn't know you are. What? You haven't rented this in no Yeah, that's from U-Haul. You borrowed it or they rent it? Rent it. What the? What? And are they rent this Yeah, 1995. You can rent this motherfucker. So you're going to so be out here outside with us? I want to rent one too. I ain't got my, uh, my lock, uh, truck got stolen. You don't need a license. You don't need a license. No, I'm saying I got license. But I'm saying I don't have it because my truck got stolen and all that and I ain't renewed it here. Insurance is like 20 bucks a day too? 20, so that's $40. I can ride that for a whole day. That'd be Yeah. Got back on that motherfucking game back control until he's yeah. a jet on his hand. <laughs> but this motor big enough, I don't have to get no power and I can just yeah. take, the whole, I'm take the whole sprocket off and, and just run it. Yeah, run it. Bigger chain, so I, I thought about using this chain, but I wasn't going to put too much throttle into it. Papa was a rolling stone. Wherever he laid his hat was his home. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My bike broke down. The chain fell off. Uh, we lost the piece, but hey, we brought you some presents. All right. I got you. Uh, I know it's getting cold outside, so I got you a sleeping bag. Thank you, bro. And then for your build, I've been a busy man. I haven't been able to get you your sprocket, but I got you that. All right. With who? And it's, uh, some graphics. And if you see, they have like uh, shine in the sun. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, man, appreciate that. Yeah, no problem. He's going in front of the back. Uh, that goes in the front, like here, like over here. Dang, what happened to everything? You took it off? No, nope. it got hit by a car. No, you got hit by a car? All this different stuff. Dang, yeah. where? Um, right from across the street when I was passing it to see how the, um, they were building the one. Yeah. I went to the store, and when I was on my way back, um, somebody had called me at the right on in, so I was going across the street, and then the car was just coming up 70 miles per hour. I ain't even going that fast, then when I look back up, he was right there. I dived across the street as soon as I dived across the street. Boom! No way. Then when it was, Did you get his insurance? No, he kept going. Dang. Hey, did you need a helmet? Yeah, you got one? Yeah, I got, yeah, I got an extra helmet I'll give you. Yeah, I jump, I jump out. You can have that. You want that one, or I got an actual helmet? Uh, yeah, you keep that one right now. Just while you ride. All right, yeah. Uh, I ain't gonna be riding. What's up? How you doing? Um, one second I'm up, getting something for my friends on. What you, what you gonna do? Put it right there. Yeah, I was gonna say I wanted to let you ride that one, but of course the right. chain fell off, so hey, soon, soon I'll let you rip that it, one. It, it ain't got no, it, it, it's not adjustable? No, no, the chain just broke off. Yeah, the chain broke. It's in my. It's just fun stuff right here. I'm a, I'm a certified technician. Yeah. So troubleshoot engine. Exactly, yeah. Cycle, motorcycle. That's sweet. Huh? Yeah, I'll come back with some money here in a second. Once I, uh, I'm gonna grab my other bike. What was it? Pops down right here. Yep. <laughs> Is that a fucking BB gun? <laughs> you have a good Christmas and New Year's though? Yeah, it was alright. Yeah. What it was, I mean, another day. Yeah, another day, yep, that's how it is, just hanging out. Oh yeah, uh, I was looking for you for that chain. Chain? I bought a clutch and it's, it's, it's way bigger than the uh, chain thing I got. Oh yeah, let me see. You got it? Let me see, I'll, I'll come back with the chain right now. 
Yeah. Oh, oh, it needs a sprocket. Yeah. Yeah, I don't have a. Oh, yeah, I see the clutch. Yeah, I don't have a sprocket. I looked. But, uh. I might have another chain. I don't care what's that. That was a small little piece. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I just ran. I was back and I, I bust the link. <laughs> yeah, put it back. Still need a little more. And then that chain, too, is. I sprayed it out with WD-40 a hundred times. I hit it with hammers, straightened it out. And yeah. It clinked back up. Like, <laughs> yeah. I know probably have to get heated up and just wear it wore in. Yeah. What up? Yeah. That's my boy, man. I got enough stuff right here to trust this for that bike. Do you really? Oh, yo, you actually do. What the heck? Oh, I got jars and everything. Yo, that's wild. That's crazy. All right, uh, sweet. Thank you. Watch this. You, you, saw, you saw those two, right? Bro, that's weird. Where the <laughs> Bro, you got a lifetime supply of dope. You want some really good weed? It's the home go. Yes, sir. That's crazy. <laughs> you weren't kidding me. You said you have enough to trade for the bike. That's funny. Sweet. Appreciate it. Hey, here you go, Dorian. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, that, that's a. Uh, I couldn't find a master link, but if you have the tools to pop it all out. Yeah. You know that? Hey, look. They don't have a master link. When you get with Yeah. Just go with a blessing. Oh. Thank you. Appreciate it. They all sit over there blowing. Thank you. That's crazy. That's so much. How you get away all my stuff? No, this right here. This is stuff. <laughs> Can I get one of those pipes? Yeah. You mind? No, no, you can't get no bottles. Bro, I just gave you a, I just gave you a chain. Now I'm like, damn, Dorian. What you gonna through? do with that bowl? You know, <laughs> give it to a friend. You know, I'm <laughs> blessing you. With people. I thought I said, what you gonna do with that bowl? You <laughs> said, give it to a friend. <laughs> you know, I always <laughs> bless a few you in there. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, yeah, give him a few. Appreciate it. Okay, no more coming. No more coming in. Yeah, yeah, you gotta say Paul. Yeah, I didn't want to say Dory in case you said you had beef with them. I'm gonna get in the end. I'm getting everybody who's been stealing. Yeah. I'm gonna AK-47 with the bullshit. I'm like, damn, Dory. Dory, you already gave me the throw in that one time, so I wouldn't put it past you. <laughs> Dory got that piece on him. I'm not talking about his butt. His gun, no homo. What's good, Dorian? How you doing? Good, long time to see. Yeah, I've been busy. School and work's been kicking my ass, but I finally caught up. You get that yours? Yeah, that's a little No way. Yeah, that's all right. All right, cool, that's sweet. Yo, Dorian got a dirt bike. No way. Seems like it's like a Suron dirt bike thing. That's sick. So the boy that came by the other day, he said he worked somewhere doing uh, what he said, uh, welding, welding something. Yeah, Seth. Yeah. Yeah, white guy. Yeah, you know. Yeah, I was riding with him. Yeah. Yeah. He, yeah, he moved to Kansas for a little bit to do some welding. Yeah. He, yeah, they like y'all big time. Too. Yeah, that's sick though, bro. Yeah, you go, you go, you can go on my bed. You go, you ain't no speed on me. It run good? Uh. You get like a little L bracket, you know what I'm talking about? No, not that. I, 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 can, I can make that strong. Yeah, you see it wired up? Is that Dorian? Hey! What up? You been asleep the whole time? Yeah, yeah, bro. I saw you left the keys in and I'm like, hey, bro, ain't no way. I'm, I'm, I'm not letting him. Yeah, I know, bro. You can't leave it over there. I know. I was watching it, though. Huh? So you, bro. No, bro. You weren't watching. I took it, bro. <laughs> you would have been gone. Too late. You wouldn't do that. would have been gone. Yeah, if I wasn't a good person, bro, everybody would be gone. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Right there, oh, yeah. Actually, all right, I have this. Somebody uh, gave me these. I don't uh, I don't like chocolate. If you like chocolate, bro. Yeah. Yeah.
You don't like none of them right there, now? So what? Uh, if, if I could steal a couple of those, that'd be awesome. Oh, what's the good? Oh my God, bro! <laughs> That's crazy, bro. Do you put this all on the on the bike and pulled it? That's wild. That's wild, bro. You got all the vapes. All different hands. Yeah. Oh shit. Those ones? Yeah. Sweet. I'll take that then. Appreciate it, bro. Hell yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I like the. That, that one's not yours. You, you stay in this one? I built one one. Yeah, I like the, the top floor, bro. That's pretty sick. Awesome. Well, you enjoy the rest of your day. See you later. I'll come by tomorrow with a tube whenever it gets here. Or Sunday if it comes in the evening. But yeah. So as y'all saw in one of my more recent videos, I brought Dorian some pallets in the back of my truck. That was Thursday evening because he said he needed some more pallets for his home. And I'm like, I asked Gentry if he had some. He's like, oh yeah, give Dorian all these pallets. I don't need them. So brought Dorian some, but there's limited space that I could carry in my truck because it's two rear tires. So then Friday morning, we get some more pallets and bring them to Dorian. Gentry got him some chips, some sandwiches and hot dogs from the gas station. Dorian said he loves hot Cheetos. So he got him a bunch of hot Cheetos. And and we brought them over. Dorian was always in his happy, normal mood, just bullshitting around, talking around, thanked us for the pallets. He put in his new tube because we were going to go ride that weekend. And he put in the tube that I got him. He was ready to ride. He was excited to come ride. I was going to give him some money to come ride with us on Sumo Sunday. He said he'd been practicing going up and down the little ditches on the side uh, by where he lived. He's, that's even why I had to bring him the lever because he crashed and... Uh, broke his lever and I'm like, oh, I got another lever for sure. I'll bring that to you. So he seemed perfectly fine. And then fast forward a few hours in the day, Seth comes over and we're working on this bike right here. It's towards the end of the day. We're all done working on it. And, Dor and Seth just said, let's go visit Dorian. We're like, okay, why not? Yeah, uh, Dorian knew Seth pretty well also because Seth was riding with me a lot. So we go to visit Dorian thinking it's gonna be a happy, fun time. And we get there, first we don't see Dorian and then we look a bit harder and we see him laid down in a very uncomfortable, unnatural position. So we're like, hey Dorian, we didn't touch him, we're like, hey Dorian, Dorian. And then one of his roommates wakes up who's living in the bottom part of the little pallet house that he had made. And he's like, like I don't think Dorian's doing too well. He like, picks him up, he doesn't move. And we're like, we should probably call an ambulance. This is not good. So we call an ambulance, Dallas Fire and Rescue had a amazing response time. I was very impressed. So good job there, Dallas Fire and Rescue. But unfortunately, it was too late and they put the thing to see if there was any chance of reviving him and they said no. So that was quite tragic and a little bit traumatic, but more tragic than anything, just that Dorian had passed away. And as we're waiting for the homicide unit or detective or whatever to get there, we're talking to Dorian's roommate and he said that He'd been going crazy with the drugs. And this is not to put Dorian down or anything. Uh, everybody has their problems and stuff. I just wanted to say that. So if any of y'all are doing drugs or anything or have a problem with drugs, please get help so you don't have the same issues as Dorian. Because nowadays, especially, drugs are laced with everything. I would not recommend drugs. I'd really recommend y'all get help because if we can get one positive thing out of this video, it'd be if you're doing drugs, just Please stop, it's, there's nothing good about them. Well guys, sorry to make a sad video, I just wanted to let you know why Dorian wouldn't be on the channel anymore, but more importantly, to kind of memorialize and celebrate Dorian's life and like remember all the great times that he brought us because that's important because I feel like he might get looked at as weird, crazy or whatever, but he was a human being at the end of the day and he was a great human being, a nice person always cracking jokes, always put a smile on my face whenever I went and visited him. Like there was never one time where I was like, you know what, that Dorian dude, no, it's always it's like, see you. I always say, see you Dorian, like smiling, laughing. And yeah, so just sad video to make and yeah, RIP Dorian.